Hello lovely people and newbies. So today I will be doing a review on the lip bar. Um, these are three colors and I bought her some of her skincare. The lip bar gel facial, gel facial cleanser, cleanup and daily moisturizer. Um, do me. So I will be reviewing these products a later date and I'll definitely give you an update, but I'm going to focus more on the swatches today. Ah, I came across these lippies. I was at Target and pretty sold out. Almost like every time I go to Target, I can never get my hands on a lip bar. Um, and it's no surprise that she's the number one black owned cosmetics brand in Target right now. So it explains why it's been so hard to get a hold of her lippies. Um, also, you can order these online and they're on Amazon. I want to review and see what the rave is all about. That is beautiful. Okay, that is beautiful. Okay, so I'm really feeling savage. It's like a rich chocolate color and it's lightweight. It doesn't bleed. It dries pretty fast as well. So this is really nice. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, this is this is okay. I think I'll use a brown. Um, this is okay. I'm not tripping. But however, I'll use a brown, like my brown cork lip liner by MAC. Um, I'll use it under here. Um, I think it's okay without it. I, it's kind of growing on me. Um, what you think? <laughs> Just comment below. Just comment below. Um, I think it's an okay color. You know, leave it at that. I think my favorite was the um, hoot mess. Hoot, hoot mess. <laughs> oh yeah. So let me give you a little backstory on a lip bar. So lip bar, I believe, was started back in 2012 by Melissa Butler. Um, she went on the Shark Tank with her business partner. Some of the things the verbiage that was used, I was shocked that that was okay to say that on national TV, but I'm gonna let you go ahead and check that out. However, she used the show for what the show was good for, giving exposure, because after that, I believe the lip, the lip bar went to do really well for itself. So it just shows you that Whatever God has for you, no one can close that door of opportunity. So I was really empowered by her story. And I think before that she was in Wall, she was working for Wall Street um, and she didn't really like the corporate life and she left that good job, I believe in finance, don't quote me. But um, yeah, so she went on to start her vegan lipsticks in her kitchen. So I just, I admire the tenacity. You go, Melissa, girl. You inspiring us all over here. Okay, so I do want to let you know that on the Target website, you can actually virtually try these lipsticks on. They have they have integrated the technology, yes, I believe it's AR, to allow you to see how this looks on yourself before an actual purchase. I don't think Amazon does that, but yes. Um, so yes, the price range is anywhere from $11 and some change to $13.99. Um, don't quote me, however, because they're always having sales because I believe like right now, Savage, um, Savage on her website is like $9 right now. So they're always doing these clearance sales. So beware, it's up and down. 
um, you get 10 options. There's 10 options of her liquid lipsticks. Quick, I would recommend applying a little Vaseline or a little lip balm before you apply the lipstick. Also, also it is super matte. This is like a velvet texture. It doesn't bother me, but if you are someone that's bothered by a super matte, beware, it is very matte. I believe you can pair this with a gloss from what I've heard, but um, I haven't tried that yet. But yes, so if you did like this uh, swatch and you want to see more, um, comment below on some of your favorite brands. Which of these colors, I'm curious to know which of these colors were your favorite. Um, and comment below if you want to see other swatches and other brands you would like me to review. I'm here to help you. I'm, it's all about you, boo. All right. So until next time, lovely people, I will see you soon. You be safe out there and you be blessed. Bye.